being here for this very solemn occasion. We are deeply saddened by the loss of Officer Reginald J. Gutierrez. And on behalf of our entire city, we offer our most sincere condolences to his family, his loved ones, and the men and women who wear the Tacoma Police Department badge. I have ordered the lowering of all flags in city government, and I'm now requesting that we lower all flags in Greater Tacoma to show our respect and our gratitude for our fallen officer. Ever since this happened and we got the news, there's something that I've witnessed in this community. An outpouring of love and support for our police officers and their families. A desire for people to want to show their respect and gratitude to our police department and all of those who work every day to serve and to protect us. This city is now united and we are resilient. And there are many people who really want to show their love and support. So there are a few events happening tonight that will allow people to do just that. There are two vigils taking place. One on the east side, at the east side neighborhood advisory council hosting it, at 5 p.m. at the Tacoma Police Sector 4 substation located at 400 East 56th Street. At 8 o'clock tonight, there will be another vigil held at Sheridan Elementary School at 5317 McKinley Avenue East. And then anyone who would like to show their support to the family another way can make a contribution to the Officer Jake Gutierrez Memorial Fund through Wells Fargo Bank. On behalf of the City of Tacoma, the Tacoma City Council, and the 207,000 people who proudly call Tacoma home, again, we offer our most sincere condolences over this very tragic event. But as I said earlier, one thing I'm witnessing over the past evening and day is this outpouring of support from our entire community. We love our police officers. 